Good Friday morning, everybody. Matthew Smith here getting ready for daybreak. Got two and a half hours of news coming your way. A uh, number of things we'll be talking about this morning, and good news, because we always get a lot of people saying, hey, there's no good news. We got a ton of it today. So let's get started here. First thing we know, uh, State Fair, that is going to begin today. That's the State Fair in Nebraska. Hopefully more people heading out there. Remember last week we said fewer and fewer people were going to the Iowa one. So, hey, it gives you a chance to head to Nebraska this time, all the fun fair food, all the stuff. And this year they're also going to have their first marathon. So if you're planning on eating a bunch of gross food, packing on the pounds like I probably would, uh, you can run the race beforehand (laughs) so you can get, get in shape before you start losing everything. Uh, a couple of the other things going on. Uh, in Pilger, uh, we know the sad news happened with the two tornadoes coming in. Uh, Brett Michaels is now going to be visiting there this weekend, so you can actually get tickets to that and raise awareness, raise money for t- the town of Pilger. A lot of people still affected there. A lot of people still trying to rebuild. So that will be something going on. And, oh, by the way, Ferguson, the story that just seems to never go away for the past couple of weeks, uh, Third straight night of relative calm, as the uh, governor called there. They're actually now going to be able to send the National Guard home now. So we got that going. We've also got bugs in the studio. I don't know if you can see that. Rusty swatting them, trying to help us. I missed. See, you, you could have lied. You could have lied. We would have thought you were the exterminator extraordinary. No, I don't have the reflexes like that at 4 in the morning. <laughs> um, let's see. What do we got going on today? A lot of pollen in the air. Ragweed is through the roof. So if I sound like I'm talking like this all morning, that's why. Uh, I have an excuse to come to work with a cold now. That's what I view that as. There you go. Uh, What do we got going on today? Clouds will decrease this morning. Uh, Temperatures will climb low 90s again, but the humidity is going to be up there. Dew points today, mid-70s. That's worse than it's been pretty much all week. So the air is going to be thick and only a north-northeast wind at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So that's not going to move it around much. So I can't poke a needle in that and make it rain or anything. Not huh? at all. <laughs> about a 30% chance of a storm after 5 o'clock. Got storm chances tonight. And then, well, the weekend's still in the 90s, too. So. By yeah. the way, did you hear the boo? Boo. <laughs> Wait, the cr- the floor crew over there. booing you. Oh, well. Not the first time. <laughs> all right, so humidity returning to Omaha. I mean... Worse humidity. Increasing. Increasing. There we go. That's why he's the meteorologist. I just get paid to read words. Hey, a number of other things going on this morning. Uh, Some of the harder, tougher news to talk about. Uh, There was that bad crash on the South Omaha Bridge uh, yesterday. Uh, This morning, we now know the names of the people involved. We know a little bit about their uh, injuries. Uh, Some pretty bad ones, but everybody is expected to survive. Uh, uh, Actually, a teenager in the hospital this morning. She uh, got the worst of it. We'll tell you all about that. Uh, also, some other things going on. There was an overnight crash. Not too terrible. Not not anything that we're going to uh, worry too much about what's going to happen to people. They'll be all right in that one. Uh, Gaza airstrike, those things continued overnight. Uh, pretty bad. More than 20 uh, strikes from Israel's military. And, oh, by the way, that Japan mudslide that we've been talking about this week, they said there were somewhere around 20, 30 people missing. Now they're saying 51 people missing. So pretty bad situation unfolding there after some bad weather in that area. Number of things we got to get through this morning. That's just the tip of the iceberg. We got a whole lot more coming your way for the next hour and a half. Two and a half. Doing math. Two and a half hours. Apparently, don't get paid for doing math either. Same length every day. All right. Two and a half hours of news coming your way in about eight minutes. We'll see you then.